What's going on everyone? Welcome back to T3G. My name is Dalibor and today we are reviewing this tripod ring light coming up. All right, now I understand I'm wearing a different shirt, but that's because I wanted to keep my genuine reaction from the first time I tried to do this, but I did want the better audio, so here we are with the better audio. Let's go ahead and talk about this tripod light thing. Now, it is very much like the the little attachable ring light slash stand. It does have a phone mount. It is on an arm that is not bad, but it attaches to a spot that's a cold shoe, which makes me believe that I might be able to get a different device in here, possibly definitely a mirrorless, maybe even a DSLR, we'll see what happens. But it is very much the same kind of ring light, just bigger, right? You have your controller here, which is the same exact one that we had on the other one. The power button is lit up blue when the light is off. It turns off when you turn on the light. And then you have your three different temperatures. You have your yellow, your mix, and your daylight. And uh, then you have 10 different brightness levels. Okay, and then we'll go back down. But what I did find with this one, because I was just playing around with it, if you hold, it will then just increase gradually all 10 levels. And that's nice. I bet the other one does it too. It's, again, it's the same control system, so I can't imagine it doesn't. Now, because this light source is just larger, you're going to get, a, I feel like, a little bit softer light in general. And uh, you can't see the the... the individual LEDs as much as you can on the smaller one. This does have a much wider footprint as, and it needs more space to work in, but I think it's worth it because you have the much larger light source and you're just gonna have a much nicer look. Overall, I think this is solid. It is not quite as convenient as that one. I've used that one for all sorts of things. A bunch of the shorts that are coming up, those were filmed on the attachable one just cause it's always there and it's got the light and the stand all in one. It like it's, it's super useful when it's when it's just kind of there, right? You attach it to your desk, and then it's out of your way for the most of the day, and then you're like, I have an idea, let me shoot this real quick, and you just adjust it, move it, or just lean it down to, to get yourself some coverage. Like, it's super useful. This is still very useful, but it's very much an intentional thing. This is going to have its own place. This is not something that you can really put out of the way, right? It, you can fold it up and stuff, but I mean, like, for it to be just, like, instantly usable it's not gonna be quite as easy because you're gonna need to free up space or create space for this thing to be, whereas that attaches to the edge of a desk and pretty much every edge of a desk is free. Now this light does have a quarter 20 hole on the bottom, so you can remove this tripod and attach it to, well, anything, right? So I think with that in mind and with the, the cold shoe, we're gonna try to figure something out to see if it'll work with a different camera and if it'll work with a tripod or a boom arm or something that's going to give us even more options as far as what we can do with this this definitely feels like more of a piece of the kit like the overall gear that you have as opposed to that like super useful version of this which just attaches to your desk and it's just kind of always there i talk a lot about just doing the damn thing and eliminating obstacles and eliminating barriers to entry that's just going to promote you doing the damn thing right that thing being right next to me and me not having to think about all right where do i get a tripod to like film this top down no i just move the move it over boom done like i'm good to go if i was to say only have this a top down becomes a much more complicated process because now i have to figure out how to mount this light and it's a whole thing whereas that just is Overall, this is a very solid light. I absolutely think this is worth the money. Yeah, without question, if you are interested in it, link down below. Of course, it's an affiliate link if you use it. I appreciate you very much. It helps out the channel. That's gonna be it. I don't have much more to say. It's a solid light. I'm into it. And I'm thinking about ways to maybe mount it onto this desk for the comic book content, which is coming. I'm making plans. I've got lists of videos. You guys will see. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.